awkward. Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly. If you are new here and if you are returning, then I already know how I feel about you. Today, we have a day off. Once, for once, we have a day off. So, we are running to Goodwill. That's why you see those trash bags back there. We have a bunch of stuff. I cleaned out our closet. So, we're going to take that, donate it, and then Cam's getting a haircut. I brought my book. I think I already told you guys about that book, but I brought that so that I can read while he's in his haircut. Then we're gonna meet up with Kelsey and Greg at the mall. We're gonna get some food, watch the game at 5.30, shop around, and just have a little day. So, like I said, I have a day off today. I didn't wanna waste it. So we are going to meet up with friends and have a good time. We are, what time is it? It is 1.10 right now, so kinda early on a Sunday. We are headed to the barber shop. Then we're gonna go ahead and head on to the mall. I don't know when we're gonna drop the stuff off at Goodwill, but that'll be in the plan at some point today. And, oh my gosh. Yeah, that's all I have going on for the moment. Um, I'm obviously gonna take you around with me. Maybe this will be a little shop with me. I don't know, I don't know what we're gonna get into, but it's gonna be, it's gonna be good. So, see you soon. We made it to, Oh, let me get out of this damn trigger. We made it to the barber shop. Sorry if it's cutting my head off, but yeah. Oh, I'm just gonna sit here. You know the unspoken rule: girls can't go in the barber shop. So sit here, be on my phone, read my book. I said in the last clip that I had talked to you guys about this book, but I actually don't think I have. It's called The Wife Upstairs by Rachel Hawkins, and I'm not very far in it, but so far it is really good. I'm really enjoying this. Um, it's this girl. She's like running from her past. And she moves into another neighborhood like she you know she goes from state to state and the neighborhood she lives in is not like a really nice neighborhood but she walks dogs for this really nice neighborhood she walks dogs for like a couple of the homeowners there and she meets this guy and he's a widower his wife died in a like tragic boating accident with her best friend but it's looking like maybe she's not up. She's not. I was gonna say she's not upstairs. It's looking like she's not dead. Hence the title, the wife upstairs. But I don't know. I haven't really figured out. I haven't figured out the main character's past, and I haven't figured out like what's going on with the guy she's now dating and his ex. Well, his late wife or kidnapped wife, whatever the heck she is. But yeah, so far it's really good. Um, sorry, I, I sound stopped up. I am like it's freezing out here. It is now what March 27 so we're we're full into spring and it is cold like winter time so yeah but I'm gonna sit here and read for a minute and hopefully he'll be done soon it's 1 his appointment was at 2 then we're gonna drive over to the other mall and meet up with Kelsey and Greg like I already said we said around 3 so we'll see I don't know probably a little after 3 I think it's gonna take us like 30 minutes to get there so I'm gonna catch up with them, read my book, and I will see you guys once we get to the mall. Oh, before I go, they have this ice cream place, and I only like ice cream when it's cold outside. I don't know why I'm like that. Like, when it's warm out, I don't want ice cream. I feel like that's gonna make my stomach hurt, but when it's cold out, I love it. So, they have this ice cream place in there, and they had like this cake batter ice cream with like Teddy Grahams and frosting and sprinkles, and I don't know why that sounds so good right now, but I can't wait. So, <laughs> I'll see you then. I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, ET, two-turn baby girl, you know me, still with the dolls that go inside, all the niggas round me, die, 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 die. gotta watch the time, cause it's fine right by, I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, ET, two-turn baby girl, you know me. I'm 
outside in the AMG, right outside. Okay, so as you just saw, we ate at Dave & Buster's. So literally everything I said before, those clips just disregarded because we didn't do any of it. We didn't go to the mall. We didn't see Kelsey and Greg. We got Cam's haircut. We did drop the stuff off at Goodwill, which I didn't record. We just literally dropped it off. And then we came to Dave & Buster's to eat and watch some of the game. And now we're headed to Cold Stone. And then we're taking it back to the house. There's really nothing left to do. We didn't um, meet up with Kelsey and Greg because Kelsey was asleep, so. By the time she woke up, we had already started, you know, back to the house. So, now we're going to get cold stone. Something I don't need, but it sounds very good, so I'm just going to get it. And, yeah, I'll probably just continue this vlog tomorrow because I'm going to run out and do some stuff tomorrow. And this wasn't very much footage, so, yeah, we'll just keep it going. I'll show you what I get from cold stone in a minute. All right, y'all, got the cold stone. Let me focus it up a little bit better. Got the cold stone, so I got the cheesecake base, like the cheesecake ice cream with cinnamon, yellow cake, and graham, graham cracker crust. This is what I get each and every time. What'd you get? Birthday cake remix, Wait. but with cheesecake. Instead of cake batter ice cream. Instead of cake batter, yeah, so. First time I got something different, 12 years. Oh, wow, okay, so he gets this. Every time, damn near, and I get this every time, and you can't go wrong. Good morning, guys. It's the next day. Ooh, it's my butt. Please excuse the way I look. I just woke up. I just woke up and moved to the couch. Mm -hmm. Knox is so smart. I thought he used to just hear the camera beep, and he'd know what I'm doing, but now he hears me talking, and he knows what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm watching YouTube, by the way. But yeah, so... I guess he thinks the camera's a toy. I don't know. I feel like I say this every vlog. I still haven't figured out why this is like his arch nemesis. Like, I just don't understand. But anyways, good morning. It is the next day. <laughs> the last thing you saw was probably me at Dave & Buster's. Um, that's all we did. Oh, no, you saw me get cold stone. So, after that, we just came home. I was so tired. I took a shower and got in the bed. I read for a little bit. And today, I need to go get my eyebrows down done first and foremost my eyebrows look atrocious so i need to do that i need to oh i want to go to bath and body works it's not necessarily a need but i want to go to bath and body works get some wallflowers they have new scents out um and then i need to go to the grocery store that is a need so we'll do that and at some point i need to go to the gym today too but as of right now what time is it it is No, get down. Look at this. You need to get down. Okay, anyways. he's just, He just doesn't listen to me. So, it's 10.56. And I need to do all of that. But I might just go to the gym this evening. Am I rambling? I feel like I'm rambling. You probably... No one wants to hear this. They just want to see some action, right? Okay, so I'll talk to you when I leave the house. Ooh, I might have figured out the cheat code. Okay. I'm sorry that... Let me turn this down. <sighs> all that static because I'm in a parking garage. But... Okay, deep breath. Um, we are headed out. We are going to get my eyebrows done. Ooh, it's bright out here. Because they look atrocious. And then we are going to go to Bath and Body Works. I have two coupons. And I want to use them. Because I feel like I always get them and I never use them. <laughs> and they're stuff I want. So it'll be perfect. We're going to go do that. Sorry this angle sucks. And sorry that it's so dark. Is this a... So, yeah, my car is not vlogger friendly. Like, I think I've told you guys that. Anyways, I just have on this hat because my hair is a mess. I have on just this regular black shirt, this jacket I got from Paxson, some old navy jeans, and my Uggs because it is still freezing out here. But that's where we're going. And I keep feeling like I want to go to Target, but I, it's just, I don't need to go to Target. I truly don't. So, I'm going to try to stay out of there. And I need to go to Giant, the grocery store. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to do that because we need stuff. Like, yeah, we just need stuff. Um, I don't know, maybe I'm kind of liking this angle to me. We're sitting here talking about the Will Smith stuff. Uh, 
Okay, anyways. Um, I'm sorry. Don't cancel me, but I don't think that... Um, I feel for Will Smith, okay? I'm going to just say that. I'm not about to condemn him, condemn him or cancel him or whatever for that little stunt. Anyways. I want to go to the movies. I want to see the new Batman, but that's... I saw this other movie that's out. It's called, like, Uma. Yuma? Something like that. But it looks like a scary movie. And I love scary movies. If y'all don't know, I do. Um, and if you're new here, I'm a flight attendant and I have a couple days off. Today is Monday. I'm off until Wednesday. So, technically Tuesday night. So, when I go back on call. So... I'm out enjoying trying to get some stuff done that needs to be done. I've been talking about going to the grocery store. I mean, last weekend we were not, well, okay, last weekend we were because yesterday was Sunday. So that weekend we're, we were here, but we just kind of hung out. And the weekend before that we were in Charlotte. I didn't vlog because I had planned on it, but it just, it didn't work out. So we are doing a day parentheses off in the life of a flight attendant. I'm just fucking rambling at this point. I really don't know what to say. Ugh, I want to talk to you guys. But I still have to GPS everywhere I go. Like, I know where I'm going and I know how to get there, but I don't feel confident unless I have the GPS on. Is that anyone else? <laughs> is that, like, this is going on year two that I've been living up here and I'm still like, nah, I, I need the GPS to, like, be for sure that I know where I'm going. Also, if anyone has any recommendations for, like, spot treatment on the skin on your face please let me know oh Cordoba is open now yes okay i've been waiting for that Cordoba to um open up finally oh maybe i'll go there for lunch okay that might be a plan but yeah if you have any spot treatments for your face i feel like okay so i usually take the collagen peptides like in my coffee and i feel like that would clear my skin up but now i don't know maybe like my skin's getting too used to it because i feel like it's not really working i'm sorry it is so dark y'all Hey y'all, I'm gonna talk to you once I get to Bath and Body Works. All right, I wanna see if you guys can, <laughs> you probably can't see literally anything, but I was gonna show you my eyebrows. Oh, my skin looks so bad. I don't even know if I'm gonna include this clip. Like, well, first of all, my lashes, my gosh. I cannot wait to get them done tomorrow. Um, So just don't even, don't pay attention to that. But my eyebrows look atrocious. But she's gonna bring me back to life so okay we got them done i think they look better hopefully you can tell what what is what is happening what is that okay whatever you know what just focus on the eyebrows they look much better i have hair everywhere and it kind of makes my skin dry but god we got that out of the way now we're gonna go to bath and body works i'm not even gonna show you on the way there my dad just called so i'm gonna talk to him <music> All right, we got some good stuff. Uh, and I had a coupon, I had two coupons, so I'm very happy about that. Cause I thought, the way I was picking stuff up in there, I was like, okay, you need to leave because <laughs> this price is gonna be way too much. But actually, I only paid like $57. And of course I'll do a haul when we get home and I'll show you what we got, but here we go. Perfect. But so far, so good. This little area is so cute over here. It has Ulta. Um, pot belly there's a giant which i might run into that giant i'm not sure just yet but some other little shops over here you probably can't see to be honest i don't even know why i'm trying but it's very cute oh they have a chopped chipotle mm, love it We just finished in Giant and in Bath and Body Works, as you can see. Yay! Casey just made it to her vacation destination, so she texts me. Oh, I can't text when my fingers are cold. 
All right, so we spent enough money for the day. We we're going home. Hello. Okay, baby. Okay. All right, here are all the groceries I got. I'm back home, obviously. I'm gonna give you a quick little grocery haul and then we'll get to the Bath and Body Works. So, all right, I got this dip. It's called, Bo oh, is it focused? Bodacious onion, this stuff is so good. It's like a French onion dip, but a little bit spicier. So this is really good. And piggybacking off of that, I got these sweet peppers. Usually I would dip them with chips, but I'm trying to be a little healthier. You know, summer's coming, so. I got Cam some deodorant just for him to try, some ranch, a lot of salad toppings. These crispy onions, love them. Cheese, um, I got Caesar dressing, Cam loves that. I'm gonna make like lettuce boats out of this. Then I got some broccoli, just to you know, throw in a pan. This veggie and noodles, I usually get the veggie ones. I've never seen the veggies with the noodles. So, I'm gonna try that out, it looks good. I got more salad, just for something quick and easy. I got bacon to go in the salads, cucumbers. Um, I got these seasonings for like meat and vegetables and whatever else. I, I love the Mrs. Dash because it's salt free. And this McCormick, this is also salt free. I love those, and then onion powder, obviously salt free. Um, these, these bacon and cheddar crisps, they are so dang good on salad for a salad topper. Sometimes, hell, you can even eat them by themselves, but I got bacon bits. Clearly, we love bacon, if it'll focus. I got pork chops, because they sounded good at the time. <laughs> so I'll just like fry those up. I got these chips and these chips, because they were two for seven, I believe. These are really good, I've had them before. And these, my theory was, my reasoning, that they're so hot that maybe I'll only eat two or three, and I won't be like stuffing my face with chips. I got this um, Cheerios Oat Crunch Cinnamon cereal, which I've had it before, it's really good, but I'm not a cereal eater, so mark my words, I'll probably have like a couple handfuls and be done with it, and I don't like milk. I got red onions for salad. I got these pre-made wings. I got a garlic parm and then a sweet chili, and these are just good for when you're hungry, like right now, and just wanna throw them in the air fryer, you don't wanna do anything. These are so good for that, but yeah, that's, pretty much all the groceries I got. And I'm gonna put this away and then we'll get to the Bath and Body Works. Look at my girl out here living the life, y'all. She in Curacao, I think I'm saying that right. But yeah, out here just in the middle of the ocean living her life, love that for her. Text me back. <laughs> okay, yeah, better sit back like this. Hopefully you're focused. Sorry this harsh light is like cutting through me. Ugh. Whatever. Okay, so here is what we got from Bath and Body Works. Just a small bag. Um, okay, I'm just gonna pull stuff out and show you. So this is called Marble. It's their men's collection. I've never smelled it and then, oh, it does smell good. But you know when you're in there smelling things and all the scents just get kind of jumbled, that's how this was, but I like the way it looked. And I'm pretty sure I liked the way it smelled when I sniffed it, but I wasn't sure what I was truly smelling. But yes, this is good. I got this for Cam. I do like it. So, I got some of their wallflowers, which hopefully I'm going to try and upload this this evening, but it's March 28th. I think the sale will be going on no later than tomorrow I'm going to have this uploaded. So, look online, ladies. This is like, or gentlemen, whoever. I think they were like $3.95, I think. But anyways, I got Prosecco and Peaches. You know it's kind of hard to smell the wallflowers when you're in there, but that did smell good. I got a hand sanitizer. I love to keep these in my flight attendant bags, in my purse, wherever. I got the white t-shirt. I'm simply obsessed with this smell right now. It, it just smells so good and so clean. I love it. I had a coupon, so I got this little hand cream for free. Again, another thing I love to keep in my purse or in my flight attendant bag. This is called Saltwater, Saltwater Breeze. It's one of their shea butter hand creams. It does smell pretty good. I don't see like a description. Yeah, it doesn't really say what it is, but. All right, I haven't gone to Bath and Body Works and got like body spray, body lotion, body wash, and I can't tell you when, but this scent has a hold on me, white t-shirt. You screenshot and go get you some. It smells so dang good. 
So yeah, I am just. Mm, you cannot beat that. And the description on this is crisp pear, fresh white t-shirt, lavender cloud, clean must, soft sandalwood. It is so good. So dang good. Another wallflower, I got Fiji White Sands. But you know what, I'm so mad at myself because I went in there specifically for wallflowers, but I wanted Black Cherry Merlot. I did not get one of those. I totally forgot when I was in there. I saw one that was dark, it's like a deep purple. So I saw one and I was like, oh, this must be it. I picked it up, it was not it. And I smelled it, went on to the next thing, never thought of it again. Just completely gone. So I walked out of there without any of the dark cherry or black cherry Merlot, whatever it's called. But that was specifically the wildflower I wanted and I did not get it. So more white t-shirt. So obviously this is the fragrance mist and I got the hydration body cream. So the and they're having buy three, get one free today. Or I feel like they have that a lot. So I'm saying today, but Oh, I got a white t-shirt in the wildflowers. I love that scent, ladies and gentlemen. It is so good. Laundry day, anything clean, which is why I love white t-shirts. It smells so good. And then I got a jingum. And then to follow with the jingum, this is the last thing I got. I got a jingum whipped body butter because I had to buy three to get the fourth one free. So I was like, I may as well. Let's see. And I used to really love this scent. Oh yeah, that smells so good. It's gonna smell so good for like the spring and summer too, so. All right, I'm pretty satisfied. I don't know, I'm gonna go read my book. I'm obsessed with that book right now and it's really getting into some like, oh my hair's sticking up, some deep stuff. We're like unraveling her past and his past, so good things ahead. So I'm gonna sit down and read for a minute. I don't feel like I'm gonna end the vlog here, but then again, I'm not really doing anything else. Tomorrow I'm going to get my lashes done, thank God. But yeah, I think I will just end the vlog here because tomorrow I'm gonna be trying to get myself together for work. And I mean, maybe I'll film that, just packing with me, even though I'm pretty much packed. I don't really unpack my suitcase, honestly. I'll take stuff out, wash it, but then I just throw it right back in there. But maybe I'll just do a prep for work with me vlog starting tomorrow. That might be good. I'm trying to push more content on my channel, think of different things to do, especially around flight attendant lifestyle. Y'all love that, so yeah, okay. Well, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you more than you could ever know if you ever use my codes or my links or anything like that. You are so appreciated. You just have no idea. I'm just so grateful and so thankful to you and to God. It's just amazing. But anyways, thank you so much for being here. If you haven't already, go ahead, click that subscribe button, tell a friend to tell a friend, hit the like, leave me a comment, tell me anything. Just tell me how your day is going. Literally tell me anything. And <laughs> um, I'll see you guys on the next one.